What's up everybody, NZ Walcott here. This video is going to be about swapping my my watch my components from one artillery to another. At the moment I have one artillery that is mixed out. I've modified right to the hilt. Parts or gold parts. The I want to swap that and put it onto my Liberty Howitzer. At the moment, we can see it's 1.978, 1.9 1 mil firepower. And going by that, I have one, two, three, but I don't have it maxed out. I'm nowhere near maxed out on this own. So if I look at this one, it's just just a smidge over two mil power. So let's restore this, max out the liberty, and see how we go from there. My overall power with units alone, because I don't have my. airplanes actually well let's train them so we find out what my total power is and as you can see with my airplanes I didn't focus that much on them I'm starting to focus a bit now on my fighter plane I should have did it from day one I do have a bomber that's a seven star but the old fighter planes seem to do quite a bit bit of damage so easy kills so we'll wait till this this uh, trains up then I will check the then we'll disassemble it we'll restore it But we'll wait. We'll, we'll wait a bit. Wait until that so we know what my my power level is. Like it says 30.7 mil power. Let's get some housework out of the way and done with. What have we got? Oh, yeah. Four and a half, five, so I got a light, heavy, and a medium. Here's a light. And, and it's, if this is what it's like when you know, different power levels, if this is what it's like, power difference between a a Russian howitzer to a Liberty howitzer, I'm going to change it up. I'm, go I'm going to at least get another 7.2 star. As you can see, I have a 7.2 star Liberty howitzer. That's what might made a difference when I upgrade my one of my Russian howitzers to a 7.2 star, then they, that might make up the difference. So we won't find out until I actually till I get there. I want to have I, I want to utilize my my rocket launcher. I want to try and max that out as much as I can, possibly even chuck in Antonina when she is maxed out to get that extra grid space, because as you can see, it does say down, where is it, there, effective range, 4 kilometers. that's only 3 grid spaces. With Antonina, it gives me 4 grid spaces, even though it's a waste having her in there, but... 
be effective if they're attacking my base and many of those people don't have a maxed out Antonina. You know, it, it won't affect the people that have that maxed out in that one unit. But in doing that, you know, that's what I'll... I'll use the pop in and out method. Anyway, let's check it out. I'm 31.4 mil power so far. That's with my units all fully trained. So we will... Better check first. I'm in the front lines at the moment. I can afford to actually just kick back a bit. All right, let's get rid of this one. Restore it. Hundred and twenty-three k ammunition, one hundred and thirty-four k components. Damn, that's a long haul to get there. Bloody long haul. Anyway, let's restore this. And first off, I want to. Why is it saying parts? Oh, yeah, my firepower. I really want to upgrade that firepower. We'll wait a little bit. Let's see. Let's mix this out. All right. Two point four nine. Huge difference. Huge difference. All right. I like that. I definitely like that. Do I swap it up? Yeah, I'll swap it up. I will take and if I do I put the Russian parts on there? What's the downfall to it? Camp Liberty unit assemble reaps 30% parts enhancement. Will I lose that 30%? Why do I hear troops? Oh. Oh. Let's hurry up and train this. I wish they had a setting here where it would just max it out. Instead of going through it, it gets quite tiring. I don't mind using this, uh, using the, how I've swapped it over to the Liberty Howitzer, make it, making it my strong, strongest unit. Reason being is that with the other, the Russian Howitzers, I am utilizing the camp buffs. Mm. 
I'm not going to have this mixed up, but hey. Wish I just have one set button and yeah, it pops up. If you got enough, if you have enough components to fill in each tier, they should have a button down the bottom or something that shows select all and do it all in one hit. It's in the heat of the battle. This is a real pain. Hopefully they do something. They'll be able to fix it. Parts are all on there. Be good if I could put that firepower onto my other unit. 2.5k firepower. I like that. I like that. Now, I might swap the officer over. The two officers. Alright, well we can see my howitzers, well my unit's still training, I have 30.9, I've still got, let's add another three more, four more, well, what was my original power, 31.4? It has increased my power a bit. I just, I want to see. I, I really want to see my. My. Um, total firepower. I'm a bit new to using the Liberty Howitzer. But hey. Thirty one point three I dropped. Power wise I dropped, but in firepower I think I gained. I've got a whole airport above me. The boys They're still trying to, uh, still trying to heal their CC. We'll clean them out soon. When we get enough on. Oh, one more. Doesn't really take much to do these, and you get a lot of you get a lot of rewards. Combat drills have just finished. Battle honors have just done. Now, everything we're in the last week now. Be good to go back in. 
Good to go back to bloody get out of Moscow. Fighting the same guys is, you know, does help. Well, we can't really do nothing, so. Let's. Who's this? I just heard someone. He's got no troops. Two seventy three point four. Loving this how it's a bad mood, brother. Bad mood. I don't mind losing my. I really don't. Pulled out his artillery. That, guys, is a short video on how not to move your base. Compliments of DAO. Oh, no. Oh, lucky it's one of the boys. Anyway, I'll leave this video nice, short and sweet. Just to, just to recap on this video, I was doing this as in to change my artillery over from my main artillery. I had one howitzer, uh, Russian howitzer, and now I've put it, now I'm I'm liking the, the Liberty howitzer. More power, probably because it's a 7.2 star, I see that, I, I definitely see that, but the quick firing... Yeah, I've seen a lot of videos, many of videos that actually state that the the firing is a the load time. I I'm taking it that possibly War Machine would be good to have as a secondary officer to that artillery. Because of the load speed. What's Antonina? Does she have load speed? Artillery firepower thirty percent. Oh, does it? Does it? I think I prefer that. Troop damage twenty percent. Yeah, I think I prefer that. Now I think I'll leave it the way it is. Anyway, if you like this video. Don't forget to like it, comment, 
if you want to know anything more you know if there's anything else that you're unsure of or maybe stuff that you could correct me on don't hesitate to to comment all right then thanks for watching laters